So um, I posted a first video of my death wobble and I've had many people tell me I should wear gear with my scooter. So I ended up buying like a chest protector, which kind of has paddings and stuff all around my arms. And I don't know if you guys have noticed, but I've got knee and shin pads. Um, I don't know if it's too dark here, but let me go in the sun, as you guys can see. Um, this does come with a back protector, but I'm wearing a backpack today. I didn't really want to wear it. Let me show you guys. I have a wire here for my mic, so. And then here are my knee and shin pads. But it's a pretty cool view here. Pretty sick. I hate the squeaky noise in my helmet. So the thing is, um, this is pretty much my helmet and I have the GoPro mount here. So it doesn't close like all the way, which kind of sucks. That's why I feel like air will slip through in here. And I feel like the mic will pick up a lot of wind, but just got to test things out and see how it goes from there. But yeah, but this is what it looks like with the filter. Um, the mic is connected to my MIDI mod, not the actual like mic inside my headset. So it might sound kind of shit. But let me show you guys my helmet setup. So this is what it looks like. I usually have a chest mount for my GoPro. Today I wanted to test out the chin mount. So this is what the mount looks like, which I got from Amazon. It's attached to the back over here. So this is where I put the GoPro. And right here, this is the mic. Uh, wire which connects into the media mod and yeah that's how I get to record my voice and stuff like that and then I have this whoa. and then I have this little headset uh, when I want to listen to music and stuff the wires are pretty much sitting at the back of the helmet and that's how I record my voice when it comes to writing but this is pretty much it and this is the visor it can't close all the way because of this chin mount, but yeah. Let's explore that side of the trails. I think it'll be cool. Let's see what it looks like. I'm not really experienced with driving off-road, so I don't plan on going too fast. Uh, maybe within time, I'll get used to it. Let's see where this trail leads us to. The only thing I hate about riding the trails is a lot of bugs. I don't really like it. Way too many bugs here. Yeah, the other day I was talking to a guy here in the trails and he told me this pathway uh, leads to a dead end. Which is kind of scary. Look at this shit, it's so beautiful. What is that? Oh, I'm tripping. I'm just scared of eating shit. I'm not really experienced with riding in areas like this. It is a dead end. Gotta turn around and back out there.